Hello all, uh, so I have a quick and dirty mnemonic for um, remembering multiple endocrine neoplasias. So that's MEN1, 2A, and 2B. So the easy way to do this is to remember that the you have more P's at the top and less as you go down, right? So more, less. So that means you're gonna have the most P disorders at the top here. So you're gonna have your pituitary tumors. You're gonna have your pancreatic neuroendocrine and you're gonna have your parathyroid adenomas. Oops, excuse me. So you have three Ps here. And then you're also gonna um, see that your M's increase. I'm oh, sorry, so I'll just put the arrow going up. My bad. And then your M's increase as you go down. M's increase. So now you're going to have one less P, one more M, right? So we're going to have our parathyroids. We're going to have... Um, Pheochromocytoma, so pheo, and we'll have medullary carcinoma of the thyroid. So now we have two P's, one M. So now we're going to decrease our P's by 1, increase our M by 1, right? So now um, here we have just one P, so that's the pheochromocytoma. And then we're going to have the medullary carcinoma as well. And finally, we're going to have mucosal neuromas. So now here we have 1P, 2M. Oh my gosh, I'm running out again. 2M. Does that make sense? So 3Ps, 2Ps, 1P. 0M, 1M, 2M, um, and then you can see that this last one here is the same for both of them, so ME, MEN1 and 2A both share the parathyroid adenoma, and then 2A and 2B both share the pheochromocytoma here, and the medullary carcinoma of the thyroid. I hope that mnemonic helps you guys. That's kind of what I use. Thanks. Bye-bye.